Come on to the back. We gotta holla at you for a second. Be right there. Come on back. <laughs> what it's all about, see, is product. Recognize, recognize, recognize ability and shit. You know what I'm saying? You got product, what the fuck I'ma do with that if ain't nobody buying my shit? You know what I'm saying? Flat out. <laughs> that's that new hot shit. Yeah, that's the new CD right there. <laughs> Big tricky. <laughs> hey, you can keep that one, Cal. I mean, ain't no CD in there right now. I couldn't afford to press them up, but it's an ill box though, right? Got that little stamp on the front, tells you what the hits are, so that way you ain't gotta independently verify and shit. <laughs> Just like it's real. What the fuck it is real? Goddamn real. I mean real like something you get at Target. Target ain't selling his ass, and you know they got the best up at Target. Which is why we motherfucking here. Yeah, see, Ramadan would be the perfect spokes brother to pimp out my new album. Drop date, August 21st, three years from now. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> What makes Ramadan perfect? That he's out of jail? Prison. And he's trying to turn his life around? That he kills somebody. Bang. That's the image you want for your music. Come on, man. We trying to sell shit to hardcore brothers. Mm -hmm. Only thing they care about is the four B's. Bitches, mm -hmm. blunts, mm -hmm. bling, and Ebonics. <laughs> Ebonics doesn't start with a B. Them niggas don't know that. But look, the thing is, I just talked to my lawyer, and they told me that you Ramadan's full-time employer. Mm -hmm. He's on parole. So that means I gotta get the okie dokie from you to work with him. <laughs> you can't afford to make an actual CD, but you got a lawyer. Ain't that some shit? <laughs> we in America. <laughs> wow. Ramadan's gonna be a spokes brother? <sighs> Finally related to a celebrity. There's no wow. There's nothing wild about somebody wanting to use a convict to sell their crap. 